My name is Chief Godfrey Kill Kalajak Ishi. Welcome. This has never happened before. This information here. Oh yeah. Not in this lifetime. This is what they have hidden from us all of our lives. This information has never been revealed. They don't talk about it. Mm -mm. So once you understand this, you can't put no price on this. So understanding that, these numbers are cheap. Oh yeah, the truth to the kingdom that is coming, the kingdom of heaven coming on earth. The kingdom of heaven coming on earth just as it is in heaven. Yeah, yeah. This that city right there. Charleston was only created to do a deed, to do a purpose. Charleston has a history of slavery as does America have its history of slavery. But no one can say that it was only created to sell slaves. But Charleston, only created to sell slaves. Now when you understand that, that, that changes everything. Charleston is that city. Charleston is the holy city full of lies. Less than 1% black tour guides. Less than 1%. Over a thousand certified tour guides. Four black owned businesses. And then the truth does not matter. In the number one city in the world, the truth does not matter. And when you tell the truth, they're offended and tried to destroy you. Hmm? History. Why lie about history? And history, black history. Why lie about black history today? Hmm. Charleston is that city that is historically and biblically significant. Historical and biblical, the Holy Bible. Charleston is that city that the prophet Moses spoke of specifically. Charleston is that city that the prophets were lynched on hanging trees. Acts chapter 5, verse 30. Uh, Galatians 3, 13. Hmm. Deuteronomy 21, 22. The hanging trees are here. The most popular hanging trees in the world are here. We have perfected lynching people, killing people. Huh? The gods of our fathers huh, slew Jesus Ooh. by hanging him on a tree. Now that's what the book said. And we got the angel oak tree. Mm. The most popular hanging tree in the world. Man, please. Charleston is that city. When the Hebrew Israelites went free, Moses said, if you keep Gala, if you keep Gala, then these blessings are yours. From verse 1 through 15 are the blessings. The blessings. But from verse 16 through verse 28, he tells you that if you do not keep Gala, what? Gala Gichi. Because you don't understand what Gala truly means, you may be a little confused at what Moses was saying. Mm, look at that. Because Gala is ancient Hebrew for redemption, but pronounced the law. It's the law. If you keep the law, the blessings are yours. Gala. If you do not keep the law, if you do not keep Gala, Gala, if you do not keep Gala, then these curses are yours. Do you keep 
Gala today? No. Is Gala proper today? No. Do you tell the truth about Gala? No. Why does the truth not matter? Why is a lie okay? Charleston is that city that has perfected the lie, the bloody city. Ooh. Mm -mm -mm. Deuteronomy 28, verse 68. Verse 68, Moses gave a prophecy. There's only one book with prophecy in it. And in that book, he said, and a terrible thing will happen to those Israelites if they didn't keep Gala. He said in the future, they will go back into slavery again with ships. With ships. Again, you're going back into slavery again with ships. And by the way, what's your nationality? We don't like that question. What's your nationality? Why you don't like the question? Because you don't know the answer. Oh, by the way, whereof I speak unto thee, you are not going to see your homeland no more again. Because African American ain't on the map. It was made up in 1989 by Jesse Jackson, Charlotte, North Carolina. Oh, my goodness. Tuesday, January 10th. Look at that. 1989. Made it up. And by the way, whereof I speak unto thee, you will never see your homeland again. You don't even know where you're from. How are you going to find your way back home if you're black? And there ye shall be sold as slave man and slave woman, and ain't no man going to buy you, no man going to free you. Because Christ is Gala. Christ is the law. The king to fulfill the law. If you keep the law, if you keep Gala, then you can be saved. You can be redeemed. No man will buy you because, because Christ owns you. The Messiah owns us. And he coming back to save us. His name has to mean savior. He, she. <laughs> Gichi. This is that city. Mm, 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 mm. That black people still don't know about. We don't show up. And when we do, who's giving you your information, your black history? And what is history really about? What is life about? Yeah. Boy, look at y'all, boy. Mm. Mm -hmm. I'm looking at you. Ishi, what's happening? Ishi. What's happening, man? Mm. The truth matters. Mm. Black truth matters. So, that's why this is that city. St. Philip's Episcopal Church, the first church in the South, known as the Queen on the Chester. Mm. The street goes from the market all the way down to the other side of the city, to the Atlantic Ocean. Look at these trees in the churchyard. Look at these hanging trees in the church. Look at these bears. I mean, meaning that they're normally pretty clean. Mm -hmm. But this is where they're going to polish you off at. 
they're gonna take you up to the top. You step out, they're gonna make sure that you're clean and beautiful. Put the pig fat on, you get you all shiny up. Oil, oil you down. You walk out these double doors. Presenting to the audience for sale.